Welcome to Bathtub Party Licks, where the only thing cleaner than the licks is my criminal record now that the statute of limitations has run out. <laughs> you didn't know December 5th was National Bathtub Party Day, so whenever I feel like having a bathtub party, I call the guitar guy to stop. Um, this is my first time being invited to a bathtub party, and what kind of crime did you um, commit? Not important, we need to get to the licks. Okay. Oh, excuse me. Oh, this is kind of this doesn't way, sound right? very. This is in my way. A this doesn't bit. sound right. So when I think of a bathtub party, I think of like a rocking kind of pentatonic thing in G minor, obviously. So if you could just play a G minor chord, kind of like uh, something like that, hit me, hit me with that good stuff. G for goddess. That screams bathtub party to me. Okay. So we're gonna show you how to play that lick and then talk a little bit more about just, you know, tubbing with friends, which is what we're doing right now. I still, I so. You don't have to act so scared. Okay, this, is, this, is a, this is a safety tub, you know? This is a judgment-free tub right now. Basically, we're gonna start with third fret on low E string, which is a G, okay? We're gonna jump to the octave which is the 5th fret on the D string. G, 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 G. Guitar goddess. See how that worked out right there? Now we're gonna do, we're gonna do the A string. Three to five, hammer on. G, G. You can do this on any minor chord in any key. Do you wanna do an A? Nasty, top, right? Because it's not like every, Every tub has its own associative key. Like this is a resonant G minor tub. So that's why we're doing it in G. Three E octave hammer on three to five party style. Cause it's kind of funky. And then after that, we're gonna go to the, the minor seven, which we did the minor scale from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, third fret on the D string. So root octave hammer minor seven, Back to the five, seven to eight. So if I, I could just number these to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, minor scale, numbers, think of numbers, always think of numbers, goddess. One, eight, four, five, seven, five, seven, eight, one, eight, four, five, seven, five, seven. I think when you end on a minor seven, it gives it that like that bathtub party feel. You know, that vibe. Mm -hmm. They're like, you're in a tub. What's your like typical bathtub party look like? I mean, this is it. Yeah, like you know? no bubbles or anything? Well, sometimes. I feel like my bathtub party would have lots of bubbles in it. Well, maybe we could do a collaborative effort with more bubbles on your channel. That'd be in awesome. In your bathtub. I haven't always, you know, this is the only room bathroom I've ever had with a bathtub. Really? I've been kind of bathroom deprived for most of my days. It's really sad, actually. I don't really think it's that sad. No. More of a shower guy. I mean, I'm more of a shower girl, but, you know, sometimes I like to have a soap in the tub. <laughs> the, and that's the spirit of National Bathtub Day. Yeah. Which, I'm, I'm a little upset that I didn't think of this earlier, but I, it just, it always sneaks up on me. National mm -hmm. Bathtub Day, December 5th, there's a other stuff going on. So it really snuck up on me this year, so I apologize for getting this video all late. But uh, that's just that's just it. So maybe next year you'll be more prepared. We'll all be more prepared. So let's jam it out again. A little G minor, please. G G. Two, three, four. It's good. That's awesome. Keep going. Now do you know why we picked G minor? aside from your initials being GG, is because if you've been watching the Instagram channel, you'll know that I actually got a new instrument when I was in Peru, and I was tricked, because it's actually a Peruvian bird flute, mm -hmm. in the key of G minor. <clears throat> so the great thing about a, a bathtub party is you don't have to just have a guitar to do it, you can really have any instrument. Mm -hmm. So uh, let's try to do the same thing with a guitar and flute solo. All right. All right? Two, three, Four.
point is, it's not just me showing off my Peruvian bird flute, uh, it's that those pentatonic licks, those bathtub party licks can be played across any instrument. Uh, it's thinking about intervals with a major, minor scale, finding a close friend, and just sharing a tub. Because that's what music and tubs are all about. I, I can agree. They're meant yeah. to be shared. Yeah. It's selfish. Like, every time you take a luxurious tub bath by yourself, you're just being selfish, in my opinion. I just felt that. Well, yeah, I guess, you know, sometimes you need to do whatever. But anyways, that's, uh, that's a bathtub party lick for you. Uh, I think we're going to start doing more YouTube polls as to what lick comes next. In fact, the people chose to see this one. Yes, they did. Uh-huh, they won. I personally, I voted for the tree lick. She wanted to do the tree lick. But I had a lot of fun doing this bathtub, but I was a little concerned at first in the beginning about... Um, about the criminal thing? Yeah. Just, yeah, you made it though. Yeah. Again, it's, it's, it's a long story. I don't really want to get into it right now. But definitely, it goes up to her channel because she's pretty legit. And if you have any more ideas of uh, bathtub party jams or anything else, hit me up in the comment section, Instagram, the website, or Twitter. I'll talk to you all soon. Thanks. Play us out! Two, three, four!